Hello and welcome to the NetApp booth here at Synergy and our demonstration of Citrix Essentials for Hyper-V and NetApp. Before we begin this demonstration, we'd like to highlight several very important things. First, the things that you will see are backed by the NetApp 50% guarantee for both Citrix and Hyper-V. This guarantee says that you will use 50% or less storage than traditional arrays in your virtualized environment. Second, this is an extension of the 2008 Citrix Solution of the Year won by NetApp. And finally, this demonstration will highlight the partnership between Citrix, Microsoft, and NetApp. As we look at NetApp's integration with Citrix Essentials via Storage Link, it addresses three challenges that are faced by every virtualization administrator. First, virtualization requires shared storage to enable all the value-added functionality, such as motion and high availability. Second, it prevents manual configuration of storage and virtual machines, and it avoids the difficult coordination between server and storage groups. Citrix Essential and NetApp integration provides automated storage management to simplify virtual machine deployments. It provides 50% guaranteed NetApp storage efficiency, and all of this is delivered with Zen Server as a component of Citrix Essentials for Hyper-V. Before we start the live demonstration, we want to provide you an overview of what you're going to see. We have a Windows 2008 server running Microsoft Hyper-V. We have another Windows 2008 server running Citrix Essential with Storage Link and we have a NetApp FAST 3170 storage array. We're going to assign one thin provision LUN between the NetApp and Hyper-V server. We're next going to install the operating system, Windows Vista, on the LUN, sysprep it, and save it as a golden image. Next, we'll make multiple copies of that LUN using NetApp snapshots. In this case, we'll make 49 copies for a total of 50 virtual machines. We'll attach the new LUNs to Hyper-V and create new virtual machines. And then finally, we will run NetApp deduplication on the volume containing those LUNs to achieve at least 50% savings and actually much more in this demonstration. As we begin our demonstration, you'll see that we are within the Citrix Essential Management Console. This single pane of glass allows virtualization administrators to manage virtual machines, virtual machine templates, storage infrastructure, and storage repositories, all from this single interface which allows them to bring up and manage virtual machines, whether those are virtual desktops or virtual servers. We're going to further dig down into the Citrix Storage Link Manager. Storage Link Manager provides tight integration with NetApp storage infrastructure. We will look at that in more detail. As we drill down into Storage Link Manager, you'll see that we've selected the NetApp Storage Adapter. We've identified the NetApp FAS 3170 as the storage array that we'll be connecting to. We've given it an IP address and we've identified a username and a password so we can directly and securely connect to the storage array. We next select Hyper-V as the hypervisor and we define a profile for Vista desktops. As you'll see we're going to begin this operation at approximately 843. We will come back to this later to highlight how quickly and efficiently NetApp storage can be associated with these 50 Vista desktop virtual machines. Each of these virtual machines will take up approximately 10 gigabytes of storage for their operating system. As we speed up the demo, you'll now see that it's 848, or approximately four and a half to five minutes after. All 50 of the Vista desktop machines have been created. They've been created, they've been thinly provisioned, and they've been deduplicated. And what we'll see later in the demonstration is just how much efficiency will be provided within the storage array to create this many virtual desktops. Looking further into the demonstration, we see that all 50 of the virtual desktops have been created using NetApp cloning technology. NetApp cloning technology allows essentially zero cost or no space clones to be created. Once again, we validate that all 50 of the Vista desktop machines were created. Again, these were all created within a four and a half to five minute time frame. They were all thinly provisioned, deduplicated, and are highly uh, available using RAID DP technologies on the storage array. As we look at the volume, we see that it was thinly provisioned, which means that while we may have needed 500 to 550 gigabytes for the actual th uh, images, we only have allocated 200 gigabytes. And from within that 200 gigabytes, only 15 gigabytes are actually being used. So in essence, we're only using 15 gigabytes to store what would have traditionally taken 550 gigabytes or 97% storage efficiency and storage savings. That concludes our demonstration of Citrix Essential for Hyper-V with NetApp integration. 
If you have more questions about NetApp virtualization programs or would like to get NetApp collateral, please visit the NetApp Solution page on www.netapp.com or the NetApp Technical Library. Thank you.